I will choose here, I go here Bremen and I go here, I will put my script here. And after that you click and you play from here the script or you can stop the script and something like that. Or you can do something else. For example this one, I click here and if I click with my mouse here, you see, I have uh, right at kill harbor. And after that you just, you can press XK, XK, you see it's green. You start the script and you can stop the script with the same key. Start, stop, start, stop. So it's like an easy access to play a script, okay? Perfect. <coughs> so this is the script that I, I was talking about. Now uh, I, wo I will show you how to play tutorials with this auto automation. Uh, tutorials uh, that, that those tutorials are, are very useful uh, in if you want to learn uh, some methods uh, uh, okay about manual TDC about uh, rail FB and uh, thing like this uh, Trevally made uh, some nice tutorials so you can also download and install the Trevally tutorial all in one version and also the, the dry right ha have some tutorials in uh, his uh, interface so I will exit from here and I will show you how to play a tutorial because uh, we must to go back in the my menu so see you in the my menu guys so here we are in the my menu so i want to explain you how to pl to play uh, with the automation tutorials okay so <coughs> i will suggest you to download and install the trevally tutorials all in one he made a lot of uh, nice and uh, very well done and very well explained tutorials you can learn a lot of things from there so we go here tutorial click and here we, I have all the tutorials that I I had installed in my game. So I will take, for example, this one range AOB practice. I click, and you see here it's written range AOB practice. And here in uh, I it suggested what uh, what mission I, I I should play to have this one. Okay, so I'm going. I I must to play range AOB practice mission. Okay, I'm going history mission and I will search for this one, scroll down and you see he, the mission is suggested is already marked so I click on him, start and see you in the mission so here we are in game, as you see the tutorial has started by himself so in this tutorial we will look at gathering, you can read here and uh, uh, read information you can move this one where you want, ok so I go next we will look at using the study method to find target range and the map next let's get started next please go to attack periscope and activate the station remember you can walk or teleport I will choose to teleport to the attack periscope ok so here I am just a second I'll move this one here so he showed me what uh, what uh, I must to do next steps. Okay, turn the TZ TDC on. He told me. Okay, I click here. Now he told me go here and put uh, the minimal. Okay, I click here. Now he told me go and uh, raise the scope. I raise the scope. And you see, here is moving. Now he locked the target, press spacebar. So, it's spectacular, we are looking at a tanker, let's get a proper ID. Okay? So, you just uh, stay here. He told me to go here, you see? I go here. He told me to go here. I click here. Step by step. like. Very, very well done. Click here. So perfect. Looks like it's a range of medium tanker. You see, I have here a range of medium tanker. It's okay. Now it's required to use the study matter. You see. So I go next. Press L K to move the XO box. So if you press L K, you see the XO box is moving uh, to not uh, be in your uh, spot. Okay click next one you have done so next he will pop up some information you see he explain us how <coughs> what how we can use the the study matter to take the range click next 
we know the master height we, uh, from ID book, we can then measure the angle. Next, there are two ways you can access the study matter with XO or with the study matter button. For this tutorial, we use the study matter button. Next, we he told us to put our line here on the water line. Okay, I put it. Next, place a horizontal sky. Okay, I, I did. Now we, I must go until the flag, the most height part. Click next. He told me what I must to do step by step. So click the study matter button here. Okay. And now I go here as he suggested me. Okay, so now I have the range. Perfect. Next. Okay, the range. Now we look at the LB and so on. So in this uh, way with the direct interface we can you can learn how you uh, you can play the ceiling hunter 5 uh, i used that feature when i started learning uh, f about uh, three four months ago first time uh, when i start uh, start to learn about the the ceiling hunter and he, he helped me a lot uh, those all those tutorials okay so now uh, let's let's go to the next uh, next uh, step. Now I want to tell you about uh, this feature from here, which is called uh, Ship Journal. Okay, it's very nice features uh, made uh, by the Darwright in his interface. So if I'm going here, click. You see, I have uh, this Ship Journal that I'm I have like right now in my mission. Okay. Here is uh, open journal. Here is uh, save journal. Here is add entry. So I want to add an entry. Okay. So I will write here. Uh, I had some periscope troubles or problems. Do not forget to ask sober okay and I choose accept accept so uh, you see here now I want uh, to modify this one target market so I want to to write I go here and I go here edit entry and target market so uh, how I am supposed to do that okay and I I click here accept okay now I want to edit this one because I made a mistake and I go here edit I oh just a second no okay I live like this <coughs> okay so now for example this is very important because if I am playing a mission and I want I want to re, re, uh, load the mission uh, and continue playing, okay? I can now I I will be able to have import to import my journal that I had in this mission and continue with he, this uh, journal uh, and uh, for for that first I I want I will need only to save the journal, okay? So I'll go here save journal and I will say here. Uh, journal test okay and I choose accept okay so th the journal is saved okay so now for example I, I, I decide to to go here to save this mission journal test okay and I save this mission like this okay now I go back in my menu Okay. Continue. So right now I I come and I want to uh, to continue the mission uh, where I was before. You go here sh ship journal. You choose here uh, journal test. This is uh, the journal that I uh, I planned on that mission. Load journal test. I will load those this mission. Okay. And uh, in this way you can. Uh, if you are playing a to mission in a campaign or something that uh, you can import your uh, save journal is is very nice like this okay 
my camera is out of sector when you I have this I just press uh, again the camera and problem was no, no fixed so I will if I'll go to the journal here you see here I I have imported my journal my old journal you see I had some periscope problems do not forget to ask sober uh, how am I supposed to do that you see so my, my my journal was imported I can do that from uh, how I uh, told you or uh, by here for example S uh, uh, just a second is able add entry from here enter a ship journal filler name to open okay so uh, if I click here I have all my journal saved so I, I can choose from here what because for example if by mistake you choose the wrong name you can just import again in the game you see it's very nice this feature I like a lot now uh, I want to explain you about uh, the radio messages okay so let's see if here okay just a second I want to see if uh, I have these messages. If not, I must do. Schiff in Sicht. Peilung eins sieben sechs. Okay, I must go back uh, and uh, in the next step, I I will explain you about the radio messages. Okay, so next. Okay, now I I will. Uh, uh, talk to you about this feature from here radio messages you see so I can have three type of messages the red one that mean is for us very important the blue one when the video ask uh, us to to send a patrol report and uh, the ones that uh, that they are normal so this is uh, those are messages uh, from video to other uh, U-boats or general messages okay so this one so as you can see it's right uh, some uh, some ships send the radio message that uh, they spotted our uh, periscope but if i exit on the external camera y as you can see i i don't have my periscope so they they cannot see me but this is a future to to make the game uh, more on static more fun so i i will help a lot uh, with this feature because when i'm seeing something like this i know if i if i have the settings here you see click here uh, this uh, message will pop up uh, if the ship is around 8 kilometers around my my U-boat. So when I have a red message like this, this don't mean the ship uh, actually s saw me. So I I go at the hydrophone or I go to the periscope and I will search for the ship for one ship uh, enemy ship in my area or a friendly ship because I know for sure it's uh, someone in the area because I intercepted his radio messages. Okay. If uh, you don't have uh, do you, if you don't want to have message for example when I'm uh, in the friendly area when I'm uh, going I'm going out from my uh, port to, uh, in my mission I will have a lot of messages and I, I don't like that like uh, uh, periscope sighted okay so in that case I'm going here and I choose inform of, of subsai messages off and uh, when I will uh, be in not anymore in the friendly area I put this one back so like this you see you can uh, optimize your uh, me uh, radio messages uh, f and uh, you can do that also uh, from the option pi like I, I told you before you see and from